What's up guys, today's video is on the top 10 pruning saw in this year. Through extensive research and testing, we've put together a list of options that'll meet the needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's quality, price, performance, or its particular use, we've got you covered. For more information on the products, we've included links in the description box down below, which are updated for the best prices. Like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Fiskars 14 Extendable Pruning Saw. Where is our pick for the best pruning saw is easily the most versatile, hardworking pruning saw out there. The Fiskars 14 Extendable Tree Pruner occupies a different niche. It's the best tool for the job if you'll be trimming branches in tall trees. Perfectly suited for trimming branches without risking a climb up a ladder, this pruning saw from Fiskars should be your first pick for those hard-to-reach jobs around the yard. Featuring both a retractable pruner blade and a beefy 15-inch saw blade, this tree pruner from Fiskars can handle branches of all shapes and sizes. Its fiberglass pole is durable and lightweight. The fully hardened blade adds a friction-resistant coating for easier cutting, only adding to the durability and utility of this excellent tool. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Corona Razor Tooth Pruning Saw. With a silky saw, our top pick, excelled in top-of-the-line features for maximum cutting power. The Corona Razor Tooth offers a very different pruning experience. It's small, lightweight, and foldable, making it as useful for backpacking as it is for any time at home. You add in that fact that it's priced at a fraction of the cost of our top two picks, and it's easy to see why the Corona is the best pruning saw for the money. The Corona's 10-inch blade features three-sided razor teeth, the most efficient configuration for high-speed cutting with minimal effort. For added durability, the blade has been impulse-hardened, which is a good thing because there are no options available for replacing the blade if it dulls. Features for the razor tooth are rounded out by an intuitive, easy latch blade for additional safety. The number three position is held by Silky Zubat Arborist Pruning Saw. Take just one look at the Zubat Arborist from Silky, and the first thing you're likely to notice is the extremely long teeth, sporting a 13-inch blade made from Japanese steel. The full tank construction of the Zubat means that you can give it your all with every cut and never worry about damaging the blade a fine combination of comfort-enhancing and strain-reducing features. We're happy to call the Silky Zubat our best overall pruning saw. Designed with professional arborists in mind, this lightweight, 65-pound saw comes with a full-length scabbard, making it convenient and easy to transport. Everything about this Japanese-made saw screams quality. From the one-piece blade and handle design, to all metal screws and washers, to an ergonomically designed non-slip handle. Next at number 4, we have Corona Razor Tooth RS 7510 Pruning Saw. One of the most heavy-duty options that we tested for up-close and personal trimming. The Corona RS 7510 does away with the folding versatility of its cousin featured in our third spot and maximizes its hardness, sharpness, and cutting power. If you're looking for a no-nonsense saw to keep around the house specifically for dealing with branches and limbs and nothing else, the RS 7510 may just be the saw for you. The Corona's massive 18-inch blade dwarfs almost every other saw we tested, allowing it to easily cut through limbs that other saws struggle with. Extreme durability is achieved through a combination of impulse hardened teeth, Japanese steel construction, and a final heat treatment for long-lasting sharpness. The number 5 position is held by a Versa 8 Folding Hand Pruning Saw, the only saw in our review to feature an ultra-safe, gear-style locking mechanism. The Aversa Folding Pruning Saw is also one of the most compact, Inexpensive yet well-made, it's a fine option for anyone whose trimming duties rarely proceed beyond branches around 2 inches in diameter. Truly, the Versa does have a lot going for it. Triple cut teeth make for fast and easy sawing, while a textured handle makes it non-slip, but not particularly comfortable. If it were a larger saw that was capable of handling more jobs around the house, we would definitely rate it higher in our reviews. The number 6 position is dominated by Flora Guard Folding Saw for pruning. The Flora Guard is an interesting saw. It's incredibly inexpensive but has a blade that's as small as its price tag. Costing only a fraction of the price of any other saw on our list, it's a quick fix for people on tight budgets, but not a long-lasting option for anyone looking to invest in a tool for years to come. While the Flora Guard's 7.7-inch blades length may not measure up well in comparison to most other folding saws, it's surprisingly durable, fully hardened stainless steel, and triple cut teeth make it efficient at the small jobs that it can handle. An ergonomically designed non-slip handle and decent locking mechanism round out this folding hand saw's features. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Tarval 14 Hand Pruning Saw. 
with a 7 TPI blade that's 14 inches long. This curved pruning saw is appropriate for branches up to 8 inches thick. The rubber-coated, pistol-style handle is pretty comfortable and worked well for us in testing. The longer blade is nice, though this one has more flex than we would like to see. Unlike many similarly priced saws, this one includes a blade sheath. Unfortunately, the tip of the saw ended up going right through the end of the sheath, lodging the saw inside, in the process of removing it. The sheath broke completely. This was a shame because we loved that it came with a sheath in the first place. No injuries occurred, but in the struggle to remove the saw from the sheath, they certainly could have. Although it was a good saw, this major drawback is a safety hazard that keeps it from rising up the ranks of this list. The number 8 position is held by Dockapole 6 24-foot pole pruning saw. If you need to prune some branches that are way out of reach, a pruning saw with an extension pole may be the answer. This one from Dockapole is adjustable between 6 and 24 feet. With such reach, you may expect it to be very heavy. But with handle and saw together, it only comes to about 5.5 pounds. It doesn't feature the nice lever action pruning attachment of the Fiskars in the second position of this list, although it's considerably more expensive. A little higher, and we started noticing a lot of flex in the pole. Despite being advertised as a 24-foot pole, hours broke trying to saw while extended to 20 feet. It just snapped. Apparently, this problem isn't all that uncommon. While it is usable for some of the lower branches, we can't recommend it when better options exist. Next at number 9 we have Taber Tools 6 Pruning Saw. The Taber Tools 6 is a great bargain tool. The best thing about it is certainly its price. It's easily the cheapest entry on our list, and it holds up pretty well even though you might suspect that it won't. Like with any saws, the best pruning saws are those that cut well, and the Taber Tools 6 does just that. It also comes with an ergonomic handle, which makes it a pleasure to use. The handle, while it feels good to use, also feels cheap and plastic, so there are durability concerns. However, if you need a cheap pruning saw just to use once or twice, this is a great model for you. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Fiskars 15-inch pruning saw. With a 15-inch curved blade made from precision ground steel, the Fiskars Power Tooth Pruning Saw offers impressive durability and strength. The gently curved blade is well suited to trimming away branches both overhead and in low areas. Its straight teeth can cut on either the push or pull stroke, and the trademark Power Tooth Blade is great for sharp, clean cuts. A non-slip ergonomic handle and light weight of less than a pound reduce hand and arm fatigue, and a pistol grip allows for added control. With the attached handle, the entire saw measures 21.62 inches long. That's all for today. We upload product review videos in every single day, so don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the upcoming video notification.